Daniel Ricciardo nursed his wounded Red Bull over the line to win the Monaco Grand Prix and claim his second victory of the Formula One campaign. Ricardo was down on power for the majority of the sport's most famous race by the Mediterranean, but he bravely held off challenges from Sebastian Vettel and Lewis Hamilton to take the chequered flag. Vettel, who conceded defeat in the closing stages of Sunday's glamorous Grand Prix, cuts Hamilton's championship lead to 14 points. Kimi Raikkonen finished in fourth with Valtteri Bottas fifth for Mercedes. Ricardo has excelled at the Principality this weekend, and on the basis of topping every practice and qualifying session before executing a perfect start and his one and only stop for tyres, he looked destined to march to glory. But trouble suddenly struck for the 28-year-old, with 50 of this 78-lap race remaining when he reported a loss of engine power. Vettel was soon all over the back of Ricardo's injured Red Bull, and there would be more alarming news to come for the Australian. Will it get better? A desperate Ricardo asked over the team radio. Negative? Daniel, came the gloomy response from his race engineer Simon Rennie. Ricardo was denied a certain victory at the Principality two years ago when his team botched up a regulation pit stop, and his triumph hung in the balance for much of the two hours. But for all of the tracks to nurse a power issue, Monte Carlo would be the venue of choice given its lack of straights, and that it is virtually impossible to overtake. And Ricardo used all of his know-how and racecraft to keep Vettel at bay. The gap as the German crossed the line was more than 7 seconds. More follows. Follow the independent sport on Instagram here, for all of the best images videos and stories from around the sporting world. More about, Daniel Ricciardo Monaco Grand Prix reuse content.